stands alone in depth of night and eye of storm where his shadows fall you enter in ignite with hope what dark has dim and though our eyes may fail to see it is the heart that's given sight through night and storm to trust in you upon our path you are the So we welcome you to this holy hour of healing and praise on this Pentecost Sunday when we celebrate with the whole church. Bienvenidos a todos a esta hora de sanación, esta hora de alabanza. We are living in a very uncertain moment in a moment of much upheaval, a moment of much pain and strife, and in the midst of this COVID-19 pandemic, I would say we all need the healing touch of the divine flame of love. En medio de nuestro incertidumbre, nos reunimos hoy para recibir este fuego del Espíritu Santo, para sanarnos y seguir adelante. So we will continue now with a song. We will have moments of praise. We will go through these different keys, five keys for our healing, and mix it with songs of praise. So pray with us. 
And you will experience the power and presence of the beautiful Holy Spirit. Ahora vamos a cantar. Preparen el camino para preparen nuestros caminos para la venida del Espíritu. En el camino del Señor, prepare en el camino del Señor, prepare en el camino del Señor, prepare en el camino del Señor. Juan proclame en el desierto, ya se oye su pregó. tiempo de recibir al Señor y vamos a hacer la exposición del Santísimo. So, we've prepared our hearts with the song and now we're going to have the exposition of our blessed Lord Jesus.
give you thanks, Lord Jesus, for being with us. And right now we're going to, on this Pentecost Sunday, invite the presence and power of the Holy Spirit to just be with us and lead us into this deeper healing and praise. Ahora vamos a cantar Ven Espíritu Santo en inglés pidiendo nuestro Señor y Redentor que está con nosotros a enviar su Espíritu de amor. Come, Holy Spirit, come with your power, rouse in your people, come in this hour. There's a gaze of love, an intimate look of acceptance and joy. There's a smile and laugh, an eternal dance between Father and Son. Come Holy Spirit, come with your power, rouse in your people, come in this hour. You are perfect love, given above from the lover. Casting out all our fear, let us live in joy, let us live within the beloved. Come Holy Spirit, come with your power, bows in your feet. in this hour. With the boldness of saints and abandon that echoes the prophets. Like the witness of those who gave up their lives, never ashamed of the cross. Come Holy Spirit, Come with your power, rouse in your people, come in this hour, come Holy Spirit, come with your power, rouse in your people, come in Amen. Amen. Now, the first sort of uh, road and journey towards healing begins with repentance and faith in Jesus, turning our gaze towards the one who loves us beyond all telling, who contains every spiritual blessing and has been given to us for our deliverance. So I'm going to invite all of us together to turn our hearts towards our Lord Jesus. And maybe ask yourself this question today. What do you desire from Jesus? What is it that needs healing in you, in your family, in your community? Ahora vamos a hacer una gira hacia nuestro Señor Jesús. 
Él es nuestro Redentor. Él es nuestro Liberador. Y para encontrar la sanación que necesitamos, la primera cosa es, mira a nuestro Señor Jesús. Entonces, preguntar a sí mismo, ¿qué quiere de nuestro Señor? ¿Qué en mi vida necesita ser sanado? Y ahora vamos a hacer una oración. So please say after me at home, this is a prayer turning towards Jesus. Y puede decir después de mí también en español esta oración. Lord Jesus, I turn towards you and I want to give my heart to you. Señor, quiero entregar mi corazón a ti. Con todos sus dolores, sus penas, estoy agobiado y cansado y te necesito. Lord Jesus, I need you. I need you to heal my heart of its pain, of the anguish, of the hurt. Come, Lord Jesus, heal my heart by the power of your precious blood. Ven, Señor Jesús, y sáname por tu preciosísima sangre. I place my whole life and heart under the power of your love, of your mercy, of your tenderness. Pongo mi vida bajo la autoridad de tu amor, misericordia y ternura. Now while we sing this song, Jesus, heal me. You at home, please continue to offer your heart to Jesus. Whatever needs healing, continue to invite him in. ¿Mm? Mientras cantamos ahora, Cristo sáname. Por favor, en la casa, entrega tu corazón. Continuar tu conversación y abre tu corazón a la sanación que viene de Jesús. Cristo, sáname, Cristo, transformame, Cristo, renuevame, Cristo, quiero seguirte. Ya no quiero estar en la oscuridad, ya no quiero estar en la soledad. Que tu Espíritu venga sobre mí y me llene de tu luz, me llene de tu luz. Cristo, sáname, Cristo, transformame. Dame fuerza para vivir en ti, dame fuerza para amar como tú, que la llama de tu amor venga a mí y me llene de tu amor, me llene de tu amor, Cristo sáname. Cristo, transformame, Cristo, renuevame, Cristo, quiero seguirte. 
gozaré de tu amor y bondad, gozaré de tu compasión. Ay, amate, me escuchas, me consuelas, grande es tu bondad, grande es tu bondad. Señor, sánanos por tu bondad. Yes, Lord Jesus, heal us by your goodness and mercy. Ahora continuamos nuestra caminar hacia la sanación. ¿Mm? Y lo que necesitamos más que todo is, es... Perdón, perdón, perdonar como Dios nos ha perdonado. We continue our journey towards our healing and one of the most important things that helps us to heal is forgiveness. To forgive the others as God has forgiven us. And I know we have experienced hurts, traumas, pains, betrayal in our lives. So this is a moment for us to consider. Is there anyone that I need to forgive? Is there anyone that I need to forgive? Es momento de reflexionar un poco para ver si hay una persona que me ha causado daño, una herida que necesita perdonar. Entonces, yo voy a invitar a todos que están en la casa, puede decir esta oración, porque es importante nombrar la persona y nombrar lo que pasó. ¿Por qué? Entonces, puede decir, por ejemplo, Señor Jesús, ayúdame a perdonar. Por ejemplo, Juan, por disrespetarme. So when we approach forgiveness, which can be very difficult for us and challenging, All we need is just to invite the Lord to help us because from the cross he released the power of forgiveness in the midst of the violence and hatred. So what you can say in your heart after you reflect, who do I need to forgive? You can say, Lord Jesus, help me to forgive, for example, Peter for abandoning me. Help me to forgive, you know, Lisa for, you know, disrespecting me. So I'm just going to invite you now, just for the next couple of minutes, we'll be hearing healing waters played in the background. And we'll give you like a couple of minutes to really reflect. Hmm? Vamos a tomar un tiempo. Dos minutos más o menos va a escuchar la toca del piano. Y... Pensar ahora, ¿quién necesito perdonar? Y invitar al Señor, ayúdame a perdonar esta persona por esto. Porque si no nos perdonamos, 
acercamos al Señor con nuestras manos cerrados, pero cuando perdonamos, está abierta y el Señor puede darnos lo que Él tiene para nosotros. So, let's play Healing Waters. Jesus, help me to forgive John for hurting me. Help me to forgive my mother for not paying attention to me. Continuar tu reflexión. Jesús, ayúdame a perdonar. Jesus, help me forgive. Help me forgive, Jesus. So my heart can heal. Ayúdame a perdonar. Nombra la persona. a song inviting Jesus to purify our hearts now. Please, if you still have people you need to forgive, continue to name them and ask Jesus, help me to forgive. Help me to forgive. Help me to let go. Help me to release the hurt and pain. Ahora vamos a cantar Purifícame, Señor, para pedir la ayuda del Señor. Ayúdanos a purificar y liberar de todas heridas purifícame Señor con tu gracia purifícame Señor con la lluvia de tu gracia purifícame Lléname, Señor, de esperanza, y al entrar en tu morada, purifícame, transfigúrame, Señor, a tu imagen, transfigúrame, Señor. De tus palabras, transfigúrame, guíame, Señor, por tus sendas y al calor de tu mirada, transfigúrame a tu lado. ¡Suscríbete
de tu presencia, compartir tu paz. Yo no sé, Señor, si soy digno de que hagas de mi casa. I hope you all at home were able to participate and ask Jesus to help us forgive, help us let go. Hmm? That was the second key. Hmm? We turn to Jesus first. We open our hearts to pray for forgiveness and healing. And now we're going to do something called renunciation. Renunciation. Hmm? Um, you know, when Jesus went about the world, when he was in his flesh in Jerusalem and Galilee, sometimes he would enter into a house or a location and he would find someone with an unclean spirit. And he would usually say, come out of him or come out of her. So renunciation is really taking our place as baptized and joined to Jesus and asking him through his power to release and liberate whatever is unclean in us, whatever the obstacles and the fears. Ahora es tiempo de renunciar is de invitar a Jesús por su gran poder liberarnos de todos los que nos ata. De todas estas heridas. De todo lo que pues nos da tanto cansancio en nuestra vida. ¿Mm? Entonces, es como Jesús tiene este poder de decir... Váyanse a todos espíritus eh, impuros. Entonces es lo que vamos a hacer ahora. So, for all of us who are at home, please say this after me. If, if you're sitting, you could stand up so that you can stand in your authority uh, with Jesus, if you can. And we will... Say these prayers of renunciation, okay? Ahora si estás en tu casa puede levantarse y puede decir estas palabras después de mí, de renunciar todos estos, estas cosas. Hmm? So, let's say it together. Say after me. In the name of Jesus, I renounce the spirit of anger. En el nombre de Jesús, renuncio al espíritu de resentimiento. In the name of Jesus, I renounce the spirit of bitterness. En el nombre de Jesús, renuncio al espíritu de amargura. In the name of Jesus, I renounce the spirit of violence. En el nombre de Jesús, renuncio al espíritu de odio. In the name of Jesus, I renounce the spirit of rejection. En el nombre de Jesús, renuncio al espíritu de abandono. In the name of Jesus, I renounce any spirit of fear. En el nombre de Jesús, 
renuncio al espíritu huérfano. Say after me, continue. In the name of Jesus, I renounce the spirit of criticism. En el nombre de Jesús, renuncio al espíritu de autocrítica. In the name of Jesus, I renounce the spirit of self-rejection. En el nombre de Jesús, renuncio al espíritu de adulterio. In the name of Jesus, I renounce any addictions. En el nombre de Jesús, renuncio al espíritu de control. In the name of Jesus, I renounce any spirit of hopelessness. En el nombre de Jesús, renuncio al espíritu de desesperación. In the name of Jesus, I renounce any spirit of arrogance. Now, for all of us at home, maybe there is something else coming up in your heart that you know you need to renounce. So we'll give you some time, a few minutes, while um, the song is playing. Renuevanos, Señor. If something else is in your heart that you know you need to renounce, spirit of jealousy maybe you were abused as a child maybe someone has procured an abortion at some point in their life ahora mientras la música está tocando ahora puede continuar si hay algo más que necesita renunciar Tú puedes decir las palabras en el nombre de Jesús. Renuncio. Renuncio celoso. Si fue abusado, como en un, un niño, puede decir las palabras en el nombre de Jesús. Renuncio cualquier espíritu que me viene cuando fue abusado. Rompo las cadenas de estos espíritus. En el nombre de Jesús, toma mi vida, toma mi poder. If you were abused as a child or you were hurt in some way or somebody said some terrible words or curses over you, you can say in the name of Jesus, I renounce any curses, any words spoken over me. You can remember the words, say them, and then say, I break the power of these words over my life. I break the power of these spirits in the name of Jesus. So, por favor, continuar. You may continue at home, continue to renounce it in the next minute. Relationships where you were hurt or broken, you can say, Lord Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I renounce any ties or bonds, physical, spiritual, emotional, to this person. I break the bonds and the 
spirits between us and I take back my life in Jesus name so if you've had oh estaba diciendo si había otras relaciones en tu vida puede decir en el nombre de Jesús renuncio todos how do you say bonds in español <laughs> todos eh, links con estas personas rompo estas cadenas física, emociona con estas personas en el nombre de Jesús Amén a cantar una canción Cristo en mí levanta we will sing Christ in me arise and you can continue renouncing things if you have them in mind continue saying in the name of Jesus I renounce name of Jesus I renounce as we sing Christ in me arise in me arise and dispel all the darkness Christ in me arise with your power and your strength Christ in me pour out your blessing and healing Christ in me arise and I shall rise with you Be now my Open these eyes, showing me all that I must see. Onward to the kingdom, you are the way. Arise in me and I shall rise with you. Christ in me, arise and dispel all the darkness in me arise with your power and your strength Christ in me pour out your blessing and healing Christ in me arise and I shall rise with you be now my footsteps leading the way take shall rise with you Christ in me arise and dispel all the darkness Christ in me arise with your power and your strength Christ in me pour out your blessing and healing Christ in me arise Christ in me arise, Christ in me arise, and I shall rise with you. And so for all of you at home now, I'm going to say a prayer over you, asking for this blessing and release from all that holds us bound. ¿Mm? Ahora vamos a, vamos a decir una oración sobre todos ustedes en el nombre de Jesús para pedir esta liberación de todo lo que nos ata. ¿Mm? I stand in agreement with you. Estoy de acuerdo con todos ustedes. And I renounce 
every spirit you have named. Y renuncio todos los espíritus que has nombrado. I take authority over all these spirits you have named. Toma autoridad sobre todos estos espíritus. Rompo las cadenas de estos espíritus. We break the power of all these spirits over your life. Ahora ordeno en el nombre de Jesús que todos estos espíritus se vayan en el nombre de nuestro Señor Jesús. We command now all of these spirits that you have named to depart from you in the name of Jesus the Lord. Amen. Amen. So take some time now at home in the silence, keeping your hearts and minds on Jesus, and just notice whatever you're feeling And notice if something else is coming to your mind. Ahora tomamos un momento en silencio solo para notar lo que sentimos ahora y si algo más viene en tu mente. Ahora es tiempo de abrir totalmente tu corazón al Espíritu y la sanación. It's a moment to just open our hearts to the power of new life flowing from the heart of Jesus to bring us healing and peace, whether physically, emotionally, spiritually. Thank you, Jesus, for your gracious love. So take time to just thank Jesus for what you have received. Toma tiempo de dar gracias al Señor por lo que has recibido, por la sanación que puede decir estas palabras de perdón ahora. Y vamos a cantar una canción Aleluya. El amor está vivo. So we are going to sing a song now as you continue to thank the Lord and open your heart to the healing power of his life. Aleluya. Love is alive. Oh, <laughs> no, wrong song. Infinite grace. <laughs> Vamos a pedir esta gracia que viene de Jesús en nuestros corazones.
infinite grace fills our hearts, especially as we celebrate Pentecost, the fire of your love. We ask you to pour forth and renew in us this fire and flame of your love. Renuevanos, Señor, por el poder este fuego de tu amor del Espíritu Santo. So now we're just going to ask for God's blessings over us. This is the fifth key. Just ask the Lord to fill our hearts with his blessing. Because all that God desires from the very beginning is that we enjoy the blessing of his presence, the blessing of his power, the blessing of sharing life with him all the way back in Genesis. And now Jesus sends us his Holy Spirit so that we can actually have the presence and blessing of the Father and His love in us. Entonces, ahora vamos a pedir la bendición del Padre, el que desde el principio quiere llenarnos con toda bendición, espiritual, física, emocional también, que per Perdimos por nuestro pecado, pero ahora el Señor, este día de Pentecostés, nos ha enviado este espíritu de amor para que Dios puede quedar con nosotros en todo su poder y gloria y amor. So now I'll pray a blessing over you as you have prayed today. And as the days go ahead, just take note of the things you renounced because those are the little ways and the whispers, the voice of the enemy that comes to rob us and steal and destroy the blessing God has for us, the peace. Hmm? So take note, and if ever you feel yourself moving back into the darkness, you can pray, I renounce this. And turn your heart to Jesus. Hmm? Notar todos los, todas las cosas que has renunciado. Porque es como esta voz que viene del mal espíritu que quiere robar todo lo que Dios quiere para nosotros. Hmm? Y si sientes ustedes como bajando en, en la oscuridad, bajando en las aguas. Grita al Señor, ayúdame, renuncio estas cosas en tu nombre. Hmm? Okay, so for God's blessing, may our beloved, wonderful Father, who loves us beyond all telling, fill us with his blessing. 
with his spirit, with the fire of his divine love. Que nuestro Padre bondadoso, misericordioso, llenate ahora con su gran bendición, con su fuego de amor. Que llenate con esta fuerza que necesitas para seguir adelante. Ser su esperanza en estos momentos. Gracias. Thank you, Father, for this moment of healing and grace and praise. Gracias, Señor, por este momento de levantar nuestros corazones a ti, de recibir tu gracia y sanación. I bless you as fathers. I bless you as mothers, heads of your family. May God fill your hearts with a renewed love for your family. Bendice todos como padres, como madres, como hijos, hijas. Que el Señor llena tu familia y renuévate en su gran amor. Amén. Amén. Ok, ahora vamos a cantar Aleluya, Love is Alive. We will sing a song called Aleluya, Love is Alive. And then we'll allow Jesus to bless us before we conclude this hour or a little over an hour of prayer and healing and praise. Amen. Alive, the sun has arisen. 
now we will have the benediction with our Lord Jesus, our Lord who is here with us. Vamos a tener la bendición ahora con el Santísimo.
Well, thank you for joining us for this hour of healing and praise, going through uh, this journey with Jesus, welcoming his grace and power to bring about the healing that we also need physically, spiritually, emotionally, especially in this time of uncertainty. So thank you for joining us. And if you have any testimony of faith or you were touched by the Lord in some way during this hour, feel free to comment about that too. Uh, pero gracias nosotros, <laughs> gracias a todos por estar con nosotros durante esta hora de sanación y alabanza. Gracias por abrir tu corazón a nuestro Señor Jesús y a su Espíritu, este fuego del amor. Y si el Señor te ha tocado en una manera, físicamente, emocionalmente, espiritualmente, y quiere compartir, también puede compartir ¿eh? en línea. Pero gracias a todos ahora, vamos a cantar una canción en inglés, que se llama Mighty to Save, eh, que nuestro Señor tiene, tiene el poder de salvar. We'll sing Mighty to Save in English to end. never failing let mercy follow me everyone needs forgiveness kindness of a savior the hope of nation savior he can
Amén. Gracias a todos. Thank you all. Have a blessed Pentecost.